Good morning, this is Mary from Crafty Mima's Place, and we're going to make a very simple, easy thank you card because we're focusing on gratitude and thanks for all those people out there helping us make it through this virus. Uh, we're going to be working with the Ornate Thanks stamp set and dies, which is a bundle, and if you buy them together, you get 15% off. They come, they're in the Ornate Garden Suite, which is a sneak preview of some of the things that will be in the new June annual catalog. They decided to let this one out early to show everyone just the wonderful products. So this set, here's the dies. They're all kind of edge dies. They make nice little edges, just like this edge right here with the flowers. Um, and then the stamp set has all the wonderful thanks on it. So this is the card we're going to make. We're going to change it up just a slight bit by using a different color um, ink and adding a little ribbon to it. So here we go. For this card, you're going to need a piece of very vanilla cardstock. This is eight and a half by five and a half, and it's scored at four and a quarter. You're going to need a piece of gold foil sheet, and I'm going to show you what I did. I took the sheet, and it was four by four, and then I just cut it on the diagonal in half. You're going to use one of those halves. Then you're going to take a piece of designer series paper. I'm going to use the Ornate Garden designer series paper. This is the back side. This is the side we're going to use. It, this one is three and three quarters by three and three quarters. And again, I did the same thing. I cut it on the diagonal. I'm going to use one square. And then we're going to use a little bit of our terracotta tile ribbon from the Ornate Garden uh, Ribbon Combo Pack. And it, I just made a simple little bow out of it. You're going to take your edge die and just put it on the edge of this piece right here and cut it straight across. And then that piece will layer on top of the other piece, whoops, backwards, like this. And it's a really simple card that's gonna to go together real, real fast. So here we go. Putting our, put it that way. We're going to use our snail adhesive and we're just gonna take our gold sheet and we're going to put some adhesive on the back with our snail and we're just going to put it up here in the corner just right square in the corner and there you go then you're going to take your die cut piece of designer series paper put some snail adhesive on the back and you're going to put it right you're going to layer it right on top of it leaving just a little tiny bit of an edge all the way around and we're almost finished already so next we're going to add, use the stamp set we're going to take the giant the biggest one word thanks from this because the you have three really large ones one says thank you one says so grateful and the next one says just thanks we're going to use the thanks, and we're going to put that using our Stampin' Pierce Man, because this is a photopolymer, and I just really got a lot of ink on that one. So we're going to be really careful not to press too hard and get it everywhere. We're going to put thanks. And then I also took out a small sentiment that says, for all you do. Now you can you can put it above it for all you do thanks or below it for all thanks for all you do, however you choose. And then we'll put that on there. With just a little ink. I'm gonna put it below this time. There. Now in this set there are also these lovely little corner pieces. They're like a filigree corner piece. It's in the other set. I'm sorry, I was wrong. 
It's in the ornate style set. It has these lovely little corner pieces, and we're going to use those to add a little more style to it around the corner. There you go, just like that. And then we're going to just simply use a mini glue dot to put our bow on. I pre-tied this bow because when I opened the ribbon pack, I kind of cut the ribbon. Can you see that little cut there? And I decided that I didn't want to throw it away, so I just kind of made a bow out of it, trying to hide that little mishap. <clears throat> now we'll just put a glue dot on the back of it, and we can put this right here. And that is our card for today. Very quick, simple, and easy card. Um, it would be a lovely thank you card for your grocery checker when you go to get your groceries next time to tell them thank you. <clears throat> or maybe the pizza delivery person. Anyway, have a great day and come back again next week when we will be making another card for Make It Monday. Um, thanks for joining me. Come see me again. Bye-bye.